want to build today? I want to build something cool. I don't have internet. I won't have internet all Easter. I'm going to go mad. So I'm going to take this lot that I only just saw today. It's kind of... Well, I'll show you. It's here, on a in the middle of a pier, and it's very cool, and I, 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 want, to, I want to make a houseboat here. I realize you can't make a real houseboat in The Sims 4, but I don't care, I want to make one. Um, and also, I found something in the pool section. It's uh, this thing here, and also this little thing here. They're, they're little thingy-bobs that you put at the bottom of your pool, and they produce like bubbles and steam. And I don't understand how I haven't seen them before. Like, I've, I've seen them, but I didn't realize what they did. So I've kind of seen them and not seen them. Mm. But I just, I, I want to use those and I want to make a houseboat. And uh, I just want to have fun with it. So I don't go mad. Okay. See you. Hello, I'm back. Um, I have finished the houseboat now. It's, um, it worked. I actually made a houseboat. I'm staggered. I, um... I mean, you can't really make a houseboat in The Sims 4. It's not really a thing. Uh, you could in The Sims 3, though. So that's kind of what I was basing it on. I, I, I googled houseboats in The Sims 3 to get some inspiration. And uh, if you google houseboats in The Sims 3, you'll find a houseboat that is pretty pretty similar to mine. I mean, very, very, very similar to mine, actually. Um, I kind of copied it a little bit. But then I fiddled with the design and I made it kind of my own, so... Uh, but I still, uh, yeah, <laughs> I feel like I want to. I have to mention it because it's so similar. But at the same time, I I feel like I also kind of made it my own enough to not have to mention it being so similar. I, I don't know. Um, if you feel like it, you can Google houseboats in The Sims 4, and you can look at. I mean, you're gonna find it. The one that I'm, the one that I sort of kind of copied. Um, and you can judge for yourself whether or not I I am guilty of um blatant copy or whether it's okay <laughs> but anyway um i think i liked the design i went for very modern which i don't tend to do i'm not very good with modern but it's not it, it's not the worst i mean obviously i had help obviously but even like beyond what i copied i mean even even the, the bits that i did i th i feel like i did kind of good <laughs> um yeah, I mean, it could have been a lot worse. It's, it, it was, it was okay. <laughs> it's, I would even maybe go as far as to say that it was pretty good. But um, that's up for judgment. I mean, you can decide whether I did good or not. I had a break before I, I, I started this uh, voiceover. <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm talking completely staccato. Um, I... <laughs> I finished the build and then I edited it, like the rough edit, and then I went and had a break because I realized that I hadn't eaten for over seven hours and I was kind of hungry. So I went and had some food and uh, I had pizza because my, my grandma made me pizza. It was good. She, I mean, she, she kind of forgot the sauce, but that's fine. Uh, I'm, I'm not a huge, well, actually that's a lie. I'm a huge sauce person. I love sauce. Uh, of any kind, like sauce, gravy, uh, dressing, all of that, love it. But it, it was, it was fine. It was fine. It tasted all right. It tasted all right. Um, so I had food, and then since I don't have internet, like I said in 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 the intro, um, I won't have internet all Easter, most likely. I mean, there's a small chance that maybe they'll come and fix it before then because it's it's not my house internet. That's the problem. It's not my router or like the connection in my house. It's somewhere outside. So me and two of my neighbors are um, suffering the no internet crisis. But no, 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 no one else. Wow, I can't, I can't talk. But no one else is suffering it. So it's just me and two of my neighbors. But yeah, because I don't have internet, I watched the DVD. I know. It's it's crazy. I, I actually watched a DVD. I, I, like, I plunked a DVD into a DVD player. Well, it was my PlayStation 2, because I don't have a DVD player, but I watched a DVD, and it was fine. I didn't, I didn't, um, die or anything. I, I, 
it turns out you don't have to watch YouTube to enjoy yourself. I'm kidding. Okay, I'm kidding. I, I'm not that crazy. Uh, DVDs are fine. I watch DVDs a lot. It's, it's all good. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But um, yeah, I um, I watched MacGyver. I was celebrating watching MacGyver. Well, I was celebrating having finished my houseboat by watching MacGyver. Uh, if you're not sure why MacGyver is relevant for houseboats, then I'm, I'm just gonna tell you. Um, MacGyver lives in a houseboat. Not all the time. He has like a, an apartment, or yeah, he lives. He lives many places. But at uh, some point around season four, I think maybe five. Six, I don't know, I remember. He lives in a houseboat, so that's why I celebrated with MacGyver after finishing my houseboat. I struggled with this floor plan for ages, by the way. This is not the final result. I... Uh, uh, the stairs will remain where they are, but I'm not keeping all of the walls down here, so don't get too attached. <laughs> I... I find floor plans really, really hard. Um, I think, I think a lot of people do. It's... Especially when you have like just a, a box. I mean, Little Sims he says this a lot. Don't don't just make a box because the floor plan is going to be impossible. And uh, yes, <laughs> it will. But um, I just made a box because it's, it's it's a houseboat. You can't really have fancy, well, a fancy box on 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 a, on a houseboat lot. So yeah, but I I worked it out sort of in the end. It's it's kind of a weird house. Um, it has a home cinema. <laughs> It doesn't really have a setting room. But um I really like the kitchen, so some I'm I'm looking forward to showing you that. Um at the moment this is just a, a weird like no purpose hallway just to to sort of cuz it's 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 a lot of windows on the, on the lower floor and, and that's where I wanted the bedroom speak to be because I wanted this upstairs to be kind of the, the main sort of living area and the downstairs to be the bedrooms. I don't know, I just, I, I like upside down houses. It's, they're fun. By the way, those lights are huge. Why do we have them? They're, you can't really size them down either because it, it just, it doesn't really work. Uh, uh, I don't get it. But yeah, um, so I sectioned off the bedrooms so that they, they wouldn't have massive windows just for you know privacy i know sims don't care but i care i care and then in this bathroom again i just filled with it for ages because i couldn't work it out i mean it's not a funny shape it's a square and for for, for bathrooms a square is good but i wanted a shower and a bathtub and i wanted to use this really fancy like triangular bathtub that came in get together was it get together i think it was get together a lot of things came in that pack and i i wanted to use it because i haven't used it before because i only just got that pack but it was just i mean i got i got there in the end but it was a struggle it was a journey um one of the reasons was because i wanted to have obviously a toilet in the bathroom and i also wanted to have those long like floor, floor to ceiling mirrors but I didn't want them to be opposite the toilet because I've had, I've had that happen to me in, in the past where I was sitting on the toilet and I realized that there was a mirror directly opposite me and uh, I could see myself sitting on the toilet in the mirror. And uh, let me tell you, I, I don't recommend. I do not re recommend. I don't, I don't recommend seeing my reflection while I'm on the toilet in a mirror. Uh, I hope you never have to do that. But also yourself. Don't don't go to the toilet with an opposite mirror opposite you. It's it's not an aspect of yourself that you want to, you know, see. At least it wasn't an as aspect of myself that I wanted to see. So, <laughs> so yeah, I, I wish I hadn't, that hadn't happened. Um, I don't, I'm not very graceful. It, it, um, it transpires when I'm on, on the toilet. So, um, yeah, that's, <laughs> it's not a memory I, I cherish. It's fine though. It, I, I'm fine. It's just, <laughs> it's, it wasn't that traumatic. It was just not very, you know, flattering, so it wasn't very fun, but it's okay. Uh, I also find out, by the way, that the, the, the floor to ceiling mirrors, if you have the ones that are just one strip, not the three wide, but just the one wide, and you scoot two of them together, then you can get rid of that awkward stripe down the middle. Like it's, it makes one giant mirror surface, not from all angles, but from most angles. And it, I, that's much cooler than the stupid stripe down the middle, because I hate that stripes. Uh, stripe, I hate that stripe. Um, I really like how the kitchen turned out. 
sorry that I just rambled, rambled on about the bathroom while I was making the kitchen. I'm not um, very good at keeping my focus. <laughs> but, um, oh, and now we're on to the, the patio while I'm still talking about the kitchen. Well, this is going great. But I really liked how the kitchen turned out. I mean, I had a minor aneurysm when I realized I didn't put a, uh, a fridge in there, but it, it worked out. It, it fit uh, under the shelves, so it was fine. And this patio area, I, oh, I realize now how I should have done that with the sofas, because there is one, a one wide sofa that I should have put there instead, but I just sort of layered two, three wide sofas, but it's fine. <laughs> it's, it's all right. I mean, Sims can use it. It's, it's functional, so it's, it's okay. Um, and again, this hallway, I just try to do like, I don't know, some, 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 some sofas. Uh, again, I fixed it and I, I put in a front door because it's, it's just, it just seemed like there should be a front door there. And I ended up fixing this whole area. It, it looks okay now. I added a home cinema, as you do when you don't know what to do with a hallway. Just add a home cinema and demolish a bedroom. It, it, that Yeah, that makes perfect sense. And by the way, why can we not have railing on just one side of the stairs? Or can we? I mean, I've, I've complained about things in the past and it turned out that, you could, that it is actually possible. It's just me that doesn't know that I'm, I, I'm just being stupid. So if it's just me being stupid, please tell me. Um, I would very much like to know because it's very annoying not to be able to have railing on just one side of the stairs. I mean, it's it's okay in this build because um, it only clips through the wall. Well, it clips through the wall the entire way and you can only see it at, at the top of the wall, but it's still, it still bugs me. So yeah, I'd, I would love to, not, to be able to not have it be like that, but it's okay. And also another thing, sorry, I'm just whinging. Um, why do we have 400 million billion curtains and then none of them ever work? I mean, I found some that, wor that worked in this build, but like I have to go through every single curtain every time. And it's not the same one that works for every build. It's, it's different ones. Um, and maybe I'm just being silly that I don't know how to work the curtains in the build still. I mean, a lot of the times I just skip curtains because I think they're stupid. They don't have a purpose in The Sims and if, if if curtains, if we didn't need curtains in real life, would we have them? Are they that pretty? No, I don't think they are. Um, the the bathroom lights um were through the scene wing, so I had to fix that. Um, but that's that's Sims. I mean, <laughs> haven't you ever put your your ceiling lights accidentally through the ceiling and up on top of the roof of your house? Uh, well, I have many times. So um. I fixed it, it's fine. Um, and then I just put some, some, some lights above the bar because it was kind of dark, but, but I didn't want, I didn't want too much light because it is the cinema room and it's hard to turn the lights off when you're in the room. It just kind of spoils it when, when it's like bright as day and you're trying to, to pretend it's a cinema night in The Sims. But then Sims are, Sims are, Sims is just like that. And I added a mailbox and I added bins. So that's a win. And then, then I just sort of fiddled. Um, I'm really happy with the kitchen. I'm really happy with the kitchen. And I added a dishwasher and a trash chute. I don't know if the trash chute, that's really hard to say, is functional, but I hope it is. Uh, because otherwise I wouldn't have added a bin for the hundredth time running in my belts, but yeah. Uh, so this, that, that's, that's all of it, that's finished. I uh, hope you liked it, I really, really did. And um, yeah, if, if you did like it, please like it. And if you wanna see more, please subscribe and goodbye.